It's July 11th, 1956, Miami Beach, Florida. Eddie Machen takes on ninth ranking heavyweight Nino Valdez. Machen in black trunks has a good right hand, and Valdez seems to be unable to stay away from it. In round four, Machen gets in a short right, and then a left and right, and Valdez is hurt. He goes down. Machen had caused a stir in the heavyweight ranks, scoring 11 KOs and three wins in 15 professional fights. Valdez has an impressive win over Ezra Charles and has boxed in three exhibitions with the great Joe Lewis. It is said Valdez learned a good deal from the Brown Bomber. At times, Machen will cross up Valdez and lead with a short right hand. We move to round eight with Machen still forcing the action. Moving to Valdez, staying low, getting plenty of punching power. Machen scores with a left hook, a hard right to the midsection, another left, and Valdez is down. He's out. Eddie Machen was too much for a game Nino Valdez. to round eight with Machen still forcing the action. Moving to Valdez, staying low, getting plenty of punching power. Machen scores with a left hook, a hard right to the midsection, another left, and Valdez is down. was too much for a game Nino Valdez. A win for the powerful Nino Valdez would have pushed him up another notch in the heavyweight division. But Eddie Machen with superb punching power was the winner by a knockout.
champion. Jerry Quarry.